Good morning, everyone. This is David with Bolivar Live. Well, we're down here on the beachfront, and I tell you what, you just can't find a better sunrise than here on the upper Texas coast. So I uh, wanted to show it to you this morning because we've got a great weekend ahead of us. Got a little bit chance of rain. Uh, actually, I hadn't even got into the office yet to look, but you can see uh, what the surf looks like. Sun's going to get up here in a little bit, and you just can't beat a Texas sunrise. Beach is looking great, too. We've got plenty of room. Uh, I guess we're all probably on a low tide. Uh, but want to talk about something real quick that's coming up this weekend. And uh, they've actually been in my office all week uh, getting ready for it uh, for the auction part. Um, and that's the watermelon crawl. That's right, it's happening this weekend here on Bolivar Peninsula. So if you've got a Jeep or you've got a golf cart or you just want to see the parade on the beach, uh, they're going to start signing up at 8 o'clock, 8.30, I think, at, at Stingray. And the parade's going to come down the beach, but it's going to stop at several low places locations. They're going to kick off at Stingray and then come down and I think they stop at the Eagle um, and then they come down some more and they'll stop at Tiki and then they'll come go back to each time they leave a place they go back to the beach and then they're going to uh, go to the ship's wheel and then once they leave the, sh leave the ship's wheel they're actually going to come by here. Right now, we're uh, on the beach side of Camp Margaritaville, and it actually ends up at Camp Margaritaville. And so, in those that are in the parade get a swim free um, at Camp Margaritaville Saturday uh, after the parade's over. And remember, they have a great auction, uh, live and silent auction at the event got some live music going on there and so it usually wraps up about four o'clock and so this is a great family fun event in fact it raises money uh for camp margaritaville and so uh you'll be able to help raise money for camp margaritaville um at when you're uh buying items or you're in this i mean uh goes to peninsula sports park sorry about that it ends up at camp margaritaville but all the money for this goes for the peninsula sports park and that's what the auction is for is to help raise money so the kids can play baseball soccer football everything um and maintain everything you know they've got two fields now and so um, they have to keep up a bunch, but it goes for a great cause. And so uh, all the money raised from the Watermelon Crawl goes to Peninsula Sports Park. And so if you're looking for something to do or if you're going to come down to the beach this weekend, make sure that you... Um, sit on the beach in between Stingery Restaurant in Camp Margaritaville and you'll be able to see the parade. In fact, you can see the parade down by Stingery and while they're traveling, you could actually move down uh, around Tiki or the, the ship's wheel and see it again. And then you could move down again and watch them go into Camp Margaritaville where it's gonna finish. So anyway, sorry about that. I, I think I said it was going to Camp Margaritaville, and it's not. It's going to Peninsula Sports Park. And let me tell you, they've been in my conference room all week uh, getting ready for the auction, and they've got some great auction items. Uh, I don't know what all it is, but it's a room full of stuff. Plus, I know they've probably got some how, uh, house rental and golf cart rentals that you can actually go to this auction and probably get just about everything you need for a week or a weekend down here. You know, if they have a house rental, uh, and a lot of these uh, benefits down here, they do, they get a house rental. Then you buy a golf cart rental. Then you get maybe a basket or something with the area restaurant gift certificates in it. 
and you've got a complete package to come down here and all the money goes for Peninsula Sports Park. Uh, you know, Leslie and Lynn and the board, uh, which I don't know all the board, and we're going to introduce them at some point. Uh, the board, everyone puts in a lot of effort for this, and they do some great work down here. And so, just wanted to let you know, first I wanted to show you the sunrise this morning. I mean, it's just beautiful. And then I also wanted to let you know about the watermelon crawl this weekend. In fact, when I was leaving yesterday, the office, uh, they were in there working on stuff, and a gentleman said, wait, David, I need to sign up for the watermelon crawl. And I said, go on in, Leslie and Kathy and everyone's in the tourism center. And so you can still sign up if you want to sign up uh, today. Um, I'm sure if you went down there tomorrow morning and met them at Stingray, you could get more, uh, you could get involved with it. And maybe you don't have a golf cart or a Jeep. If you don't have a golf cart, call Crystal Beach Golf Cart Rentals. Uh, in fact, they're the sponsor of this event uh, this year, the presenting sponsor. And uh, I'm sure Randy could find something for you if you said, hey, I want a golf cart for the watermelon crawl uh, tomorrow. And so there's the, the banner for it. Um, it's really a neat deal. We're gonna be out during the whole event this year, we're filming all the events down here so that we make sure that we've got plenty of footage for next year uh, for promoting it. And with the new Bolivar Live TV, as of now, we're starting to put all our shows on Bolivar Live TV and they stream on their live. So you don't have to watch us on social media anymore. You can go to our website Maybe you're at work and they won't let you on social media. You can go to our website and actually watch Bolivar Live. Right now, you could go to the Bolivar Live TV on our website and watch this feed live instead of on social media. But if you don't go to the website, remember, go to our YouTube channel. Uh, we're really working on it. And YouTube and Bolivar Live TV is going to have more feeds than any any place else this year. We're gonna let you be able to do a lot more on, on Bolivar Live TV, on our Roku channel. You can find us on Roku, Amazon Fire, and now on our website where you don't have to have any social media worry about anything. Uh, YouTube also, you can go to YouTube and look up Bolivar Peninsula Tourism and Visitor Center and find us there. We're live on there. We also upload our videos to our other channel on there. And then, but if you want to see us live, Bolivar Live Live on Bolivar Live TV, go to our website. We still track it. We know how many people are going to it. And we're excited about it because we're going to be able to bring you more information, more news. And once we finally can scrounge our uh, in satellite internet. If anyone wants to make a donation to the Bolivar Live truck to get that satellite internet, man, I just think it's going to be neat once we get it because we're going to be able to drive the entire peninsula and not have to worry about. Right now, we've got a cradle point in here and we use AT&T and Verizon. But once we get that, we won't have to worry about which carrier is doing better. So, anyway. Wanted to show you what it looked like this morning. The beach is looking great. In fact, there's quite a few campers along here. Uh, we're right here in front of uh, Camp Margaritaville this morning. I was got a late start, and so we were coming down the highway, and I said, man, let's pull in here and talk about the watermelon crawl. Remember, all the funds from the watermelon crawl go to uh, the Peninsula Sports Park. This is one of two big events they have. We'll be covering the other one in November uh, because it's a great event too. The party in the park uh, where they have a band and they have a big auction and barbecue and stuff. So we can't wait to see that also or be involved with that. So anyway, this weekend, the Watermelon Crawl here on Bolivar Peninsula, there's some the flyer. And you can go to our website and get more information on this and... Um, Give us a call at the Tourism Center. Uh, Kathy will be in at 10 o'clock. 
we'll be able to get you some more information. There's still time to sign up and we're excited about it. We're gonna be uh, all up and down the, the beach. And remember, if you see the Bolivar Live Truck, make sure you stop and ask us what's free today because we've always got something free in the truck. In fact, I'm looking at the basket right now. So anyway, we're gonna head on out. Hope you enjoyed the show. Uh, we'll be back a little bit later on. Man, we've already blabbed 10 mi or 11 minutes. So anyway, you know, say hi, say bye, give us a thumbs up, maybe one of those little orange emoji smiley faces. In fact, I just updated my phone and said they gave it, it, the big thing on it was 21 new emojis. So I don't know what they are, but we're gonna have to check it out today. So we're gonna head on out. We'll be back a little bit later on with another view from here on Bolivar Peninsula. Until next time, I'm David with Bolivar Live. Y'all have a great day, great week. Come see us. God bless and bye-bye.